Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share a post by Crystal Bell. The title is, The Blood of My Children Cry Out to Me. And this word was originally posted on January 25th, 2019. To all those who love me, I know you are weary. I know that your trials are numerous and your afflictions are great. Know that I am faithful. I am true. I am with you always. Never will I leave or forsake you. I give beauty for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. In the twinkling of an eye, everything changes. Believe and you shall see my glory. I have increased the darkness as judgment upon a most wicked, rebellious nation whom has rejected me. Fear not, my faithful longing doves, for surely I come quickly. I know many of you have become weary with the repetition and the wait for you is most agonizing. The final stage of delivery has come, like a woman in travail pained to be delivered. I am. I will recompense America in full for her rejection of me. Many do not realize how late the hour truly is. Led astray by the guile of man, captivated by mammon, caught up and tangled in the world, wide web, spun by the enemy. I grieve, America. You have rejected me on your soil. My heart is pierced. My tears flow down. The blood of my children cry out with mine. Vengeance is mine. I will repay. America will burn. I have spoken. I have warned. I will not spare America, nor will I relent in the destruction. The destruction is an act of my judgment and mercy. The fire shall refine many. I am grieved to my core at the sorrow I have received on American soil. My pleas for repentance and mercy have been met largely with defiance. I am not mocked. America has rejected me. For that alone, I will destroy the nation. It is finished. One cannot fathom my sorrow and anger. I am sorrowful from the rejection I have received on American soil, my anger is birthed from my sorrow and indignation. America shall come face to face and behold the revelation, the devastation she has wrought. I shall reveal my face and all shall behold me as I truly am. Many, many will be pierced when they see the face of the one whom they so adamantly despised and hungered to expel from among them. I have loved thee with an everlasting love. Yea, with loving kindness have I drawn thee. The hatred and rejection in which America has shown me is harrowing. My cries which once echoed a nation who despises me are replaced with cries of a gravely afflicted people. The flaming sword is hurled by my hand. Reap what you have sown, America. Reap the whirlwind of my wrath. There is so much you do not yet know. How few are they who delve deeper, who hunger and thirst for truth. Destruction comes. Lo, is here. In the destruction I shall be glorified. Many shall I save. My blood was not shed in vain. I have not suffered in vain. My life was not poured out in vain. Your tears have I collected in my bottle with my own. Rejoice, my loves, for I know the thoughts I think towards you, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. I have heard, I have listened. I have answered your prayers. To all who suffer for my name's sake, who have denied themselves, picked up their cross and are following me, great is your reward, I say. Great. Arise, 
shine, for my glory has risen upon thee. My spirit dwells in you. My blood covers you. My love lifts you. I desire you. You shall eat and be satisfied. I am able. I have. I will. I did. It is finished. Jesus Christ. And that is the end of that message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.